A final brush of the hair, a touch of color. Rebecca Vischer got married two months ago, but this is her big day. It's top it up, uh, cheaper than silk. Uh, it's embellished with beading, crystals. Get it! Get it! Get it! Get it! She's getting ready to destroy her $1,300 gown. I promised I wouldn't get trashed on my wedding, so I, uh, I think today it's, it's a totally, totally different headspace. For photographers, it's all about dropping picture-perfect bridal gowns into unexpected settings, all for an edgy, untraditional shot. You really want to look gorgeous? You want to look gorgeous back? Let me look. Beautiful. It allows me to do things I cannot do at a wedding day. I can't throw someone in the water on a wedding day. I can't have them climbing up on things on a wedding day or getting dirty. It's far too precious for us. The trend started at destination weddings. So you just go to a lagoon or you'd go in the beach and you'd just jump in and, and you'd trash your dress, literally, be done, that would be it. And then, you know, a lot of other photographers kind of took it one edge up, you know, burning the dress or throwing paint on your dress or any way you could just destroy the dress at the end of the day. The trend isn't just about getting your dress dirty or trashing it completely. It's also about making an artistic statement and for many women, taking back their wedding day. I have to hear you do it. You <laughs> She's like, I'm not doing that. I had a big wedding party. There was, you know, 10 attendants plus ourselves. And, you know, it was very rushed and I wasn't relaxed. And I, I felt that in all of my pictures. I didn't, we didn't have a lot of pictures where we were just looking, you know, like we were having the time of our lives. Solaris said I do a year ago, but it wasn't until now she felt like herself in her dress. For her, trashing her dress means it didn't go to waste. I'm not going to wear it again, right? You get married and you're done with the dress. So it's going to hang in my closet. Let's wear it again and... You know, do something cool. Another memory for the dress. Ready? Ashley Burke, CBC News, Ottawa.